Spatial analysis is the process of modeling data geographically to show patterns, relationships, and trends. Start your spatial analysis workflow in ArcGIS Online with a problem or a question. For example, Loudoun County, Virginia needs a second hospital that is more than a 20-minute drive from the existing hospital, within a mile of main roads, and close to urban areas. A question arising from this problem is, where is the best location to build the second hospital? The next step is to identify or collect data that would help answer your question. When you have the data, add it to a map. This map shows some important features in Loudoun County. Explore the data you'll use for the analysis. The map contains four layers, the location of the existing hospital, the main roads, the urban areas, and the boundary of the county. You can apply the analysis tools in ArcGIS Online to the data in the layers to get more insight and answer your question, where is the best location to build a second hospital in Loudoun County? The first requirement for the new hospital is that it must be more than a 20-minute drive from the existing hospital. Use the analysis tools to address this requirement. Open the analysis pane to start the analysis. Tools are grouped by category, making them easier to find. First, use the Generate Travel Areas tool to create a travel area around the existing hospital. The Generate Travel Areas tool is in the Use Proximity category. A travel area is the area that can be reached within a specified travel time or travel distance along a street network. The travel area is also based on the chosen travel mode, such as walking or driving a car. Set the input layer to Main Hospital and the travel mode to Driving Time. Specify 20 minutes for the cutoff parameters. For travel direction, choose Towards Input Locations to identify locations from which county residents can access the hospital. Give the output layer a name and click Estimate Credits to see how many credits the tool will consume. Credits are the currency of ArcGIS Online. Credits are consumed for specific transactions such as performing analytics, geocoding, and storing features. Now you can run the tool. The History tab indicates when the analysis is complete. The new layer appears in the Layers pane and on the map. The dark purple area represents the area from which county residents can drive to the main hospital in 20 minutes or less. The next requirement for the new hospital is that it must be within one mile of main roads. You can use another proximity tool called Create Buffers to create a one mile buffer around the roads. A buffer is an area around one or more map features to a specified distance. Open the Create Buffers tool. Set the input layer to roads and specify a distance of one mile. Choose Dissolve to merge overlapping areas into one feature. Keep the other defaults, give the output layer a name, and run the tool. The buffered roads are shown on the map in blue. More analysis is needed to investigate the third requirement that the new hospital be located within two miles of urban areas. To address this, the Create Buffers tool was used earlier to create a buffer around the urban areas. The Overlay Layers tool was then used to remove buffered areas that fell outside the Loudoun County boundary. Turning on this output layer shows the result on the map. It's time for the final step in your analysis, combining the three analysis layers to identify the areas that meet all three requirements. Begin by eliminating areas that don't satisfy the first two requirements. Areas that are more than two miles away from urban areas or within a 20 minute drive of the existing hospital are not suitable for a new hospital site. Running the overlay layers tool with the erase method erases portions of the buffered urban areas that are inside the drive time area and creates a new layer with portions that are outside the drive time area.
Now use the intersect method to find areas that overlap between the newly generated overlay layer and the buffered roads layer. This creates a new layer that addresses all the requirements for the new hospital site. The areas in this new layer include only the areas that are more than 20 minutes away from the existing hospital site, within one mile of main roads, and within two miles of urban areas. This result provides a good answer to the original question and will help county officials make a decision about a new hospital site. You may want to share the results of your spatial analysis in an app. Explore a variety of apps to showcase your work. To try spatial analysis yourself using the workflow in this video, click the link in the description and visit the Spatial Analysis Tutorial Series to learn more about analysis in ArcGIS Online.